Hi, I'm Agent Mead, and this is The Lab. A strong password is key to keeping your info safe online. Hackers use computer programs, which can quickly crack weak or common passwords, and they're getting better all the time. No password is 100% secure, but we can help you stay one step ahead. For this video, we tapped into the expertise of several agents. They agree the best passwords are hard to crack, but easy for you to remember. Let's start with what not to do. Never use personal info, like your kids' names, pets' names, birthdays, addresses, your phone, or social security number. You get it. And avoid common words, cat, dog, mom, dad, that kind of stuff. Now let's talk about what your password should look like. At least eight characters, 12 is better. Use upper and lowercase letters, numbers, symbols, and you want them all mixed up. Plus, you should have different passwords for every site. That way a hacker can't access all of your accounts if they get one password. So how do you sort that all out? Hot tip, create your own unique password formula. I'll show you how, but don't copy it exactly. Your formula should be your own. Always start the same way, using something unique. I'm going to use the airport code for a city I like, Minneapolis, it's MSP. Mix upper and lowercase letters, lowercase m, capital P, then replace the middle letter with a symbol, like a dollar sign. Here's where your passwords can be different for each site. Add two letters from the website you're creating a password for in caps. I'm gonna use the second and third letters. Let's say we're using bestbuy.com, so ours would be ES. Then tack on another symbol, any symbol. Just use the same one every time. Finish with your favorite number, but don't use your birthday. So here's our example password for bestbuy.com, but yours should be personal to you. Don't copy exactly. Follow the same steps for every website you need credentials for. Here's how it would look for Gmail. You can see it's different, hard to crack, but easy for you to remember. Hot tip, some websites don't allow certain symbols. Create a backup rule just in case, like replacing them with an exclamation point or a capital letter. Even with these rules, it's good to change the formula and your passwords a few times a year. And always do an overhaul when you get suspicious emails or find out a company you use has had a data breach. If you have trouble remembering your passwords, think about using a password manager app. These apps can store them and even generate complex passwords for you but we recommend against saving passwords in your web browsers. I know, it's convenient, but if someone accesses your computer, they'd get all your passwords. I hope this video will help you create strong passwords. If it did, give it a like. And if you have a question, ask us in the comments. And be sure to subscribe to our channel for more tech tips from Best Buy. Bye.